Hello, so this is what I've been up to today, the Sunday, Sunday the 14th. And um, basically I wanted to learn a bit more about um, emitters and this uh, lovely thing here is what I ended up looking at. So I got it from um, the Peace Box in uh, Start Content and what I basically started doing was uh, looking at these three and playing around with how the emitter is made up. So I just kind of went, I turned off my smoke um, I turned off, I messed around with sparks basically and I turned off spark brush. So that's what I had. So the main things I actually focused on were like around here. Um, I was really interested in changing the colour. Uh, that was kind of annoying me a bit, a bit. I thought it was quite boring having it. Um, it was this white colour here, this particle colour. And, and I could not uh, get it changed. When I did my pressed hold or C2L and Alt, it just gave me nothing over here. So what I did was I created, obviously I googled it, and then I created a new uh, parameter vector, which or vector parameter here, sorry, which seems to be a, a running trend. It seems the easiest way to uh, change something like a base color. So um, then I went and before I did all that, I messed around with like constant acceleration, um, with a uh, color over life. And uh, some of these were quite. Uh, boring they didn't really do anything size by life I thought that would make them smaller and um, you can see here they're quite large pieces of particles and uh, with spheres there's not really many options initial size I played around with this I thought that would make a huge difference but it just seems to make them go oh that seems to be making a difference now but I was doing it and um, it it made them uh, made them huge it was like literally blocks of um blocks because I changed it to a gold and um, a brick just for the crack and um, it ended up looking horrible so um, this is actually just particles here so uh, that that's made them um, a lot smaller but what I want to do is kind of slow it down a wee bit and um, now it's, it's kind of difficult to understand what the hell is going on here so like here um here down on the bottom right sorry I'm just trying to move my here we go Trying to move my window so it can fit in between the uh, recording window. So you can see there, um, we have like start radius. So I try to kind of move these around. No idea what's going on. Um, so I suppose that's maybe the, the subject for the next one. Um, overall, I'm not really sure I could be bothered with smoke. It seems to be a, a wee bit of a, an overkill. Um, I'm looking at this kind of from an entertainment point of view, like in terms of visuals. For music and stuff and um this is quite intense for like a music event and um, it might freak people out because it's so fast so um yeah I'll, I'll need to work on on how that could be like slow down basically to kind of maybe being in line with like bpm or something like that anyway um it's all really interesting and um, i'm not really sure what this collision why this collision has gone nuts that changed when i change the material type so maybe it's got to do with the fact that it's particle type and not a dust I think it, I can't remember sorry what the original particle was but anyway hopefully I'll figure all that out okay